I'm so happy that we can unite people the way we are with this International Yoga Day and that we we have a platform for, for this global unification and to meet friends and to celebrate to celebrate life the way we can do through yoga. And it makes me so happy that the UN did this. And how did you get introduced to yoga? Um, it was through my ballet practice. And I will admit that I maybe didn't start. And to find my soul, I started to become more flexible, to be honest. But during the way, I realized that yoga is so much more than that as a lifestyle, and it makes me go through every day in a much happier mode. My name is Rebecca. Rebecca, you speak Hindi. Yes, you speak Hindi. It was very good to know that you speak Hindi. But uh, I'll ask uh, questions in English only. So my first question is, uh, it is uh, the first time that the International Yoga Day is being celebrated. What are your thoughts on it? Amazing, wonderful. It's amazing that everyone can, you know, meet up in one place and share everything that's good about yoga, all the beautiful things about it. And to do it here in Gothenburg, it's wonderful. This place is perfect. And yeah, I'm just so blessed to be here. My physiotherapist said you should start with yoga because you will keep soft and you might not have pains longer. And then when I started yoga, I realized that it didn't only take care of the neck pain, it took care of balance in life and the stress in everyday life. And yeah, you made it feel good. So once you start, I don't think I'll never stop. So you really have a very good experience of yoga. Yes, I have. And I hope that more people try it. After practicing yoga, uh, did you experience any positivity in yourself? Yes, um, I became calm. Uh, more connected with um, the surrounding, with the um, people around, especially when we used each other for supporting in the standing movement. That was really great. You should definitely try yoga. And I said, no, definitely yoga is not for me. Because I had this image of what yoga was, and I, you know, I wanted explosive sports. Uh, keep in mind, I was at a very, very bad state in my life with my, with my physical health from this burnout. And she said, okay, we're not going to do yoga, you and I. We will be doing stretching activities. And we started stretching. And uh, Linda, this massage therapist and myself, we did stretching. And then she taught me how to do stretching from the inside with breathing exercises. I had no idea it was pranayama. But we started doing stretching from the inside. And a few months later, I was standing up doing stretch practices. And I saw my reflection in the window. And it dawned on me, I'm doing yoga. <laughs> Ta några djupa, sköna andetag här. 